What's going on guys, Unofficial MCU here, hope you're all doing well, and in today's video we have some breaking news for the Marvel Cinematic Universe and the future of the MCU being officially confirmed here by Kevin Feige himself. Charlie Cox will return as the Daredevil in the MCU, confirmed in a recent interview only about a day ago now at the time of recording this video, and depending on when you're watching this video, this has officially been confirmed. Now, the catch with it that is coming from Kevin Feige is that it's just really a matter of when and where and how they plan to introduce this character and really all of these characters into the MCU. Now, for one thing, if you guys have been watching the recent Hawkeye series, a little bit of a spoiler alert out there for you guys if you're not completely caught up. Let's just simply skip ahead about 10 seconds or so. We did kind of see Kingpin a little bit here appear in the Hawkeye series or at least have a a little bit of a tease here for his character and appearing within the future of the show. Now, this year is absolutely massive with introducing the Netflix superheroes from the Marvel shows over on Netflix and bringing them into the MCU into a much broader audience and a bigger screen here is something huge and something that a lot of Marvel fans really long for. Now, in the next, of course, a couple of Marvel superheroes that we've first seen in their Netflix shows that I would absolutely love to make their way to the big screen here of course when inside of the mcu would of course for one be the punisher i think would be absolutely amazing and for another one a lot of people have been mentioning would be luke cage as well Talking a little bit about when, how, and where we very well could see Charlie Cox pop up here in the MCU as Daredevil, number one answer for as of right now would be, of course, Spider-Man No Way Home. People believe to have spot him in the trailer. There have been apparent leaks of him and so forth and so on with rumors and all of that type of stuff that goes on with Spider-Man No Way Home. You guys know how it goes down with Spider-Man No Way Home, as we, especially as we're getting closer and closer here. We very well could see him honestly appear here in Spider-Man No Way Home. I definitely think that would be really, really cool, but I'm not completely sure if that's necessarily the correct entry point for this character. Honestly, I think it would be much better to introduce his character with somewhere maybe into the Hawkeye series with Kingpin, or maybe even somewhere else down the road, and even at that, maybe with his completely own solo project, much like we saw with Netflix. Whoever said that he has to be introduced with somebody else within somebody else's respected series slash film. Furthermore, on top of that, what I like to call the cherry on the top here, the actor here for Kingpin has come out on Twitter and teased multiple times of, of how excited he is for the Hawkeye series, so as I'm definitely going to gander that we're going to be seeing more of him a pop up around here and there within not only the Hawkeye series, but also in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, definitely somewhere along the roads of Spider-Man No Way Home, I think would be absolutely amazing to see both of these characters pop up somewhere around there, especially because considering Kingpin is a Spider-Man villain. And so with that, I want to know all of your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section down below, guys. What do you guys think about having these Netflix superheroes make their way into the MCU? And what do you guys think about this official confirmation of Daredevil making his way into the MCU? I'd love to hear what you guys all think. Check out our Instagram, unofficial MCU, for more Marvel-related content. And drop a like on the video if you did enjoy it, as it really just helped with the channel. Guys, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you haven't already to be notified when new videos come out. And stick around for those future videos. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.